What's going on guys, it's the Vintage Card Guy here. Today I'll be showing you a lot of vintage cards. And we have our very first vintage opening on the channel today. 91 Donruss. I'm excited. This is a 31 year old box, which is still sealed today. You can find these practically anywhere. So, hopping into this video, we have some epic cards and we have some newer cards. So, we'll get the newer stuff out of the way here first. So, we have this 2020 Select Joe Montana die cut, which is really awesome. I have the cracked ice from this year or from that year I mean so this car is, card is really cool now we have Tom Brady next level got some Mahomes coming up Patrick Mahomes stargazing He had a great win against Tom Brady the other day. Didn't know who was actually going to win that. 20 prestige inside the number. Twenty twenty Panini. This card is really cool. I like the design. Got another stargazing here we have a 21 elite now we have two of these red foil epics We have a Jerry Rice, what is this, 96 Pinnacle Foil, which is really cool. The best wide receiver in history, not a big Randy Moss guy. Uh, 2016 Decade of Dominance. have 2020 unbeatable now we're gonna get into the vintage cards so uh, as many of you know I am trying to complete the Robin Yount run so this is a 78 I have 76, 77, 78, 79, 81, 82, 83, don't have 84, 85, 86, 87, all the way from up there. Now I have this one, then I need 80, 84, and his rookie. Then I will have it all complete. So, this is really sweet. He's really, really young in this picture. So here's the back of it. One corner's a little, a little bad, but it's okay. That's a really neat card in my opinion. Uh, we have, let's see here. One moment, please. We have this 1938 uh, Galler Tote. Um, these are this is our racing scene. So I don't have very many uh, pre-war cards. So this is really cool. Um, I hope to own a T206 sometime of a certain player. Probably in a one or a two. So. 
be pre-World War One then, which is even cooler. The most popular card being the being the Honus Wagner. And then we have this. One moment. We have this. I can't know what year this is from. I meant to look it up. Uh, this T-81 military card. I believe you can punch out the guy on the horse here. So, this is really cool. Uh, any pre-war, pre-World War II, pre-World War I cards are just really, 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 really cool. Uh, the 33 Gaudi set is cool. 34 Gaudi. Uh, the 48 Leaf set is cool with the Robinson and Ruth cards. Which are cool. And the Warren Spawn rookies in that set too. So. Now. We have. Some vintage. Uh, football and baseball cards here. We have. Yeah, this is 72. So we have a 72 tops Joe Namath. This card's in really good condition, I think. And here's the back. Next, we have this 1990 Pro Set Emmett Smith rookie card, which is really cool. Here's the back. Can't go wrong with Emmett Smith. Okay, this next card is a really big card. And may he rest in peace. Uh, Reggie White, here's his rookie card. Believe it or not, I picked this card up for nine bucks, which is really awesome. Pretty, pretty good centering on it too. The best sacker in NFL history. What a guy he was. Died really, really young. Okay, now we have some Nolan Ryan cards. So here's 1980 strikeouts. With J.R. Richard. We have 77 tops with Tom Seaver there. Which is cool. Then we have 78 tops. Phil Negro. This card's in really good condition, too. A little off center, so it'll probably be like a 6 or a 7. Okay, now we have 1984 tops. Nolan Ryan. The best pitcher in MLB history. Sadly, never got a Cy Young. Has over 5,000 strikeouts. I think it's over 5,700 strikeouts. So that's insane. Okay, here is the 83 tops Nolan Ryan. Here is. 84 tops, uh, super veteran Nolan Ryan. So that's in his, in 1966. His rookie didn't come out till 68. So cool to see a picture of him in 1966. And there will be two parts to this video. I'll be showing you the rest of these cards. And then 
will be ripping into that wax. Okay, here is 1991 Top Stadium Club, which this card is notable. When he was with the Texas Rangers, and there is his rookie card on the back there. Jerry Kuzman. I don't think anybody beats Nolan Ryan. Uh, Sandy Koufax is good too. Um, I don't think anybody will anybody will be able to match them though. Okay, now we have this 1985 uh, Topps Packers uh, Packers team set here. So I'll open these up and show you them in here. And these cards are hard to find in good condition. Because just like 71 tops, they're very easily to be chipped. Okay, so here's Lynn Dickey throwing a pass. So that's cool. And there's James Lofton's name on the back. Got his rookie card from 78 tops. So that's cool. Be sleeving this one. Okay, then we have Phil Kaufman. These cards are cool. It reminds me of 71 tops and a six tops. Oh, here he is, Lynn Dickey. Pretty cool. He was a he was a good QB back then. Then we have Mike Douglas. Okay, we have Tom Flynn. Uh, how do you say this guy's name here? Eddie Lee Irvy Ivory Ezra Johnson Mark Lee Tim Lewis I have this card I believe this is a rookie card which is cool old Rookie cards are cool. Oh, here he is, James Lofton. And Bucky uh, Skirmer. Skirner. Alright. So now, I'll be showing you, after I get these cards sleeved up here quick, be showing you the rest of those uh, junk wax Nolan Ryan cards. Yeah, I also picked up the 90 tops and 89 top set sets. So I will be showcasing those sometime. Okay get into some junk wax here we have if only I could actually know the name <laughs> 92 tops stadium club going in for a hard one there going in for a hard strikeout we have uh, what is this 92 top stadium club again 
I'm not too familiar with these cards. Uh, 87 tops. Now this is 92 tops, Nolan Ryan. 90 upper deck. We have 90 tops, 5,000 strikeouts card. We have another one in his Astros uniform. Then we have just the base uh, 90 tops Nolan Ryan card. Now we have all oh, these cards are kind of sticking together here. 90 Donruss. Um, 91 Studio. Oh, he looks old in that picture. 90 Fleer. Ninety-one Ultra Fleer. Hope you guys are liking the video of all these Ryan cards. And here we have another ninety-one Fleer. Ninety-two Leaf. A little bit of printing remnants on there. We have, ooh, we're getting into some cooler cards here. Uh, 1991 Upper Deck with Ricky Anderson there. Nolan Ryan throws seventh no hitter. Yeah, he's the oldest man to throw as many no hitters as he did. I don't remember the exact number of no hitters he had. Okay. Here is a 92 Ultra Fleer. And this card is 92 score. Pinnacle. Here we got another one of those. And we have 92 Fleer, kind of the same picture going there. Mm, now we have 93 Leaf heading for the hall. That's a cool card. I'll top load that one. Sleeve and load. That's a cool card. Okay, now we have 92 tops. Record breaker Nolan Ryan. 91 upper deck. 91 leaf. We still got quite a few to go here. All right, we're getting in some cooler cards here from 91 upper deck. We have Baseball Heroes. So here's the first one. Here's the second one. Here's the third one in his Angel uniform. Here's the fourth one when he's standing up at the pitcher's mound there. No hitter number four. These cards are pretty cool. Uh, the, what is that? Fifth card in his Astros. Uh, six, another Astros. Uh, seventh in his Texas Rangers uniform. Another one in his Texas Rangers uniform. I do believe there is a Hank Aaron series like this too in Upper Deck. Texas Rangers again with a big old smile. Now we have, oh this is kind of like the 5000K one from 90 Upper Deck. 
So here it is. And all these uniforms there. Uh, hope you guys are liking the video. I need to know Ryan cards are pretty cool, especially ones from the 70s. We have a, another one of those with Ricky Henderson on there. We have... Oh, this is a numbered card. There is only... I don't even know what this is, to be honest. Somebody could tell me. That would be great. 5,000. There's... So there's a 5,546 of 25,000 of these were made. Unless if that is the whole set. So, that's pretty cool. You know, any numbered card. Any numbered card is pretty cool. Now we got some uh, flashy cards here. And these are cookie uh cookie uh wait i don't know what these are i think these might be stickers but these are cool oh this card's cool who do we got on here it's like a bugs bunny 90s uh thingy looking kind of hard to say what it is made by upper deck though uh, another one of those. Uh, here we have a 1991 MLB Mother's Cookies card. And here's the back. So that's pretty cool. Okay, we have another, this one's 92 Mother's Cookies. Sleeving them up right away. If any of you could tell me how you guys store and protect your cards, that would be cool. I have recently updated my version of that. So, okay, here's two more. And these two are 90, 1992 Mother's Cookies. Okay, here we have these. Uh, I don't know what these are, to be real honest with you. But they are really, really cool. Uh, they're a little off-center, though. These are like a refractor looking thing from like the 1990s. Uh, here they are. Here's one of them. And a little surface issue there. Yeah, I don't really know what these are. Uh, this is when he, uh, the end of his career. So, I don't know when these really came out, but... They're cool, nice and shiny. Nothing wrong with a shiny card. Uh, here's another one of those. And the surface is, is bad again in one spot. These cards are cool. Okay, now the last two cards. These are, I think these are 1993 coaches. I got a couple of those. So these are cool, sparkly. Uh, let me know what you guys think of the video. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Uh, check out that Hank Aaron bobblehead there. Um, I'll show you guys an 89 tops and 90 tops set uh, later this week. So, hope you all are excited for that. Um, 
be excited for part two as we crack into 91 Donruss. Hope and pray we pull out Ken Griffey Jr., Bo Jackson. So, hope you all liked the video. Uh, liked all the Nolan Ryan cards and catch you in the next one and keep on collecting.